Hello, everyone. I'm Senator Jackie Rosen, and I'm honored that the Great Basin National Park Foundation has invited me to welcome you all to this year's board meeting. I'm sorry I can't join you in person. I want to thank the Foundation's Board of Directors for their dedication and their service, as well as all of the Great Basin Park staff for their thoughtful management of this beautiful national treasure. With some of the darkest skies in the country, a clear night in Great Basin is a sight to behold. Because of your in, in initiative to build an observatory and efforts to protect the dark skies from light pollution, visitors from around the world have unprecedented access to observe the wonders of the night sky. I'm so grateful for your continued commitment to supporting access to the park while still preserving it for future generations. The ongoing innovative work being done here in Nevada is critical to the longevity of the many natural wonders in Great Basin. The efforts to preserve the unique ecosystem of the Great Basin by curbing non-native species is important and necessary work and actions to maintain and restore natural plant communities is forward thinking. By supporting park programs that teach the importance of biodiversity, you are giving future generations the tools they need to ensure our planet stays healthy. All our national parks, they allow us to experience the majesty of nature and supporting our national parks could not be more important. We all know that our climate is changing and extreme weather events are an imminent threat to our national parks. I'm proud to advocate for the conservation of our public lands and national parks and support your ongoing efforts. That's why I helped introduce the Great American Outdoors Act, which was signed into law last year. That legislation built upon the Land and Water Conservation Fund providing much needed funding for our national parks across the country. This funding will address the maintenance backlogs in our national parks, forests, refuges, recreation areas, and conservation areas. Still, there's more work to be done to encourage mindful visitation to national parks. I will continue to work with you all to ensure our national park system has the funding it needs to manage these precious resources. Moving forward, I will continue to be a fierce defender of Nevada's public lands in Congress and support legislation that protects our country's natural beauty. Thank you and I look forward to working alongside all of you to keep our national parks open to all for generations to come.